Hello, RPG Dawn here. Today, we're going to discuss Yanfly's new plugin that turns your default battle system into a change turn battle system. This type of battle system makes it so that actors and enemies with higher agility go first. You can see in the top right whose turn is next, and things like higher agility and higher speed will affect their turn. My actors have the same agility, so once they are done attacking, they go to the back of the line. The bats have higher agility, so when they're done attacking, they don't go all the way back. They get their turns faster. Let's talk about how to implement this into our game, and how to adjust its settings. First, we need to download the plugin. You will need these three plugins in your plugin folder. I will leave the link to these plugins in the description. When you have them, you'll go to your games, open folder, JS, plugins, and copy and paste them here. Once that's done, you'll go back to your plugin manager. Click on a new row and add each of them. Make sure they're on and make sure the battle engine core is on top, followed by the battle system CTB and the instant cast. Next, you'll need to double click your battle engine core and change here where it says default system. Make sure it's on CTB. Click OK, OK, apply and OK when you're ready. With that, your system will already be established. You'll see the turn order on the top right and be able to attack this way. There are a few ways we can edit things such as turn speed. We will use nut tags to edit them. We'll go to our database cogwheel, then go to our classes tab. In a CTB battle system, the agility of actors and enemies is what affects their turn rate. You can find the agility in classes and double clicking agility to see your value, and under enemies, the agility bar. We can go to our skills and use any of these nut tags on one of our skills so that whoever we hit with this skill will be slowed or have increased speed. Normally you will want to slow down an enemy, but if you make powerful skills, one of the downsides to your powerful skill might be giving more speed to your enemy. For this example, I will subtract 3 speed from an enemy when this skill is used. You can be more precise with speed by using the order note tag instead of speed. This will directly change the order of the enemy, and will put the order more in your hands rather than the computer's hands. Any of these note tags affects order. If you want a skill to have more speed, which means whoever uses this skill will have their next turn faster, you can either change the speed number and invocation, or use any of these note tags to increase or decrease speed. Using the Instant Cast plugin will also let you use skills that won't use up your turn. This means that whoever uses this skill will go again immediately after using this skill. To put this into your skill, you will put this note tag, Instant. It may be a good idea to implement some downside to prevent your players from spamming this skill until all the enemies are defeated. Something like high MP cost or TP cost can help for that. Going to our actors, we can also use other commands on our actors to naturally increase their speed or place in turn without touching their agility. Any of these commands will give them a higher place at the start of the battle, but then put their speed back to normal as the battle goes on. Any of these commands will increase their speed every turn. So something like 90% or 100% will mean that they will never give up their turn or have several turns, one after another. I will now test the game to show everything that we just implemented. Since we gave her higher speed at the start of a battle, she is first. We can attack, and then she goes back to the back of the line. Since both bats have high agility, they don't go all the way to the back of the line. Their turns will come up sooner. Now, we can test each of our skills. Performance, and first we'll test our instant skill. Since the skill is instant, it is still his turn. Even though her image is in front of him, it is still his turn, as we can tell by his name being highlighted. With no downside to the skill, we can keep spamming it as long as we want. Onto another skill, Speed Down, this bat will now have a slower spot in line. It is up to the computer to determine how that works, but putting a higher number in the X will make it more likely. Since we gave her higher speed per turn, she also doesn't go to the back of the line. Choosing our Order Down skill 
will visibly show us the bat being thrown back in the order. Our speed up attack will make it so that it's his turn quicker than it was usually. You can see more commands and a list of all the note tags on Yanfly's website. I will leave a link to their website in the description. Make sure to check out Yanfly's website for other useful plugins and to stay up to date to the new plugins that keep on coming out. That's it for this video. Please like and subscribe to show your support. See you on the next video.